I'm looking forward to this one. Light heavyweight kickboxing contest between two knockout artists as Yanis Stoforidis, Hercules from Greece. He's back in action. Remember the double knockdown on his one debut last time? There it is. And who got up first? It was Yanni. He takes on Andre Stoika, Mr. KO, Andre Stoika. That up next, light heavyweight kickboxing. Light heavyweight kickboxing continues to provide high octane action. When Andre Stoika steps into the circle against Yanis Stoforidis, Hercules left a big impression on fans in his one debut, stopping the surging Bebolat Isaev in only 31 seconds. He's out! He's out! It's a win for Greece! It's a win for Yanis Stoforidis! This crowd has exploded! They both connected, they both fell to the ground, but Stoforidis took it! And Isaev fell! The Greek behemoth proved his power and his chin, but tonight he'll need all that and more to take out Romania's Andrei Stoika. Stoika has been a staple of one Super Series since 2019, with victories over the likes of Ibrahim Albuni and Anderson Silva. Left hook from Stoika, a beauty, he tagged it! Oh, this is over, it's good night, Irene! Andrei Stoika sends a message! In his last fight, he stood toe-to-toe -to -toe with one light heavyweight kickboxing world champion, Roman Kriklia, after taking the fight on only two weeks' notice. Mr. KO felt that he didn't get to show his best on short notice and promises to blow the roof off the Singapore Indoor Stadium tonight with a highlight reel knockout. It's a titanic showdown between Andre Stoika and Giannis Stoforidis. One of our absolute favorites, Mr. KO, Andre Stoika. The Romanian. And just as I said that uh, Stoforidis was carrying a proud tradition of Greek kickboxers, well, Stoika amongst the proud tradition of Romanian kickboxers over the years, the likes of Sebastian Troibanu, Catalan Monashanu, his brother, of course, Bogdan Stoika, the great Daniel Gita, and the list goes on and on and on. Oh, Dragon, this for me, you know, out of all the fights, all 15 on tonight's entire card, from lead card to main card, this one may have me the most excited as a kickboxing fan. Two big bearded brutes about to throw down. Two genuine knockout artists. Well, this is your jam. I might as well just take this match off and go sit in the back and enjoy some popcorn because this is gonna be a fun one. These guys both carry serious power and Mr. KO himself, Andre Stoika, has 30 KOs and he is, he might not have been successful against Roman Kriklia, but not many men have, but he believes that because he took that match on short notice, we didn't get to see the best version of Mr. KO, and he plans to bring that version here tonight. He wants to end this fight quickly. He wants to go in there and take out Stofridis as quick as possible. Wants to be aggressive, and he also wants to be close. He wants to close that distance, get inside, right, which is a little bit confusing to me because he's willing to trade hands with Stofridis, which we've seen before is not a good idea. The knockout artist's about to throw down. It's Greece versus Romania. The Romanian, the shorter by one centimeter, gives up a whopping amount of reach, though. Stoforidis, 202 centimeters of reach. Massive wingspan on the Greek. Three judges circle side, scoring on a 10-point must system. Three knockdowns in a round. It's all over. Let's meet them now with Dom Lau. And now, this next match is three rounds of three minutes in a one light heavyweight kickboxing contest. Introducing first, out of the blue corner, he stands at 189 centimeters tall, weighing in at 225 pounds, holding a Muay Thai and kickboxing record of 30 wins and seven losses. Training out of Karen Nicholas team, representing Greece. Giannis Hercules Stoforides! And hit 
Introducing his opponent out of the red corner. He stands at 188 centimeters tall, weighing in at 222 pounds, holding a Muay Thai and kickboxing record of 53 wins and 13 losses. Training out of Stoika Brothers Fight Academy, representing Romania, Andre, Mr. K.O. Stoika. And when the action begins, your referee in charge, Mr. Justin Brown. Athlete center. All right, gentlemen, you both know the rules. Let's keep this match clean. Obey my commands at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Let's watch the low blows and remember no holding. If you want to touch gloves, do so now. Back up, please. Justin Brown, the meat in this big man sandwich in the circle here. Inside the Singapore Indoor Stadium, a light heavyweight kickboxing. Romania versus Greece. Stay back, Stay back. Hercules. Judge, judge, judge. Mr. Ready? KO. Right, round one. Let's go. Out suddenly kick early from Stofferidis. Stoika showing patience. Takes the in suddenly kick from Stofferidis. Massive shoulders and biceps on Yanis Stofferidis. Size of his traps as well. They should have their own zip code. Enormous. Stoika's already starting to throw the high kicks. He said that would be the biggest difference in this matchup would be his kicking game because he figures that Stofridis is just going to throw hands at him. But Stofridis is starting to go for the low kicks and he's also just threw a rear leg push kick. High kick there from Stoika. Another high kick from Stoika. Stofridis goes downstairs. On the balls of his feet, the Greek. The Romanian, the more flat-footed, good low check there from Stofferidis. Both then trade kick Stofferidis over the top with a left hand out of that southpaw stance. Man, these guys are cracking already with some big shots. You can't see it from this angle, but already the, uh, what is it, the left upper arm and left forearm of Stofferidis is redded because of the round kicks of Stoika. Stoika edging forward, gloves up high, both men, very tight defense. There's another one from Stoika. Switches up off the lead leg. Right hand lead there from Mr. KO. Inside leg kick from Stofferidis. You can feel the tension here. Neither man can make a minute mistake. One punch, one kick will cause a KO. Inside leg from Stoika. Stofferidis, double jab to the outside leg kick to the back leg. Again, Stoika goes that left side of the body, that forearm, that bicep, that tricep, deltoid area. Good distance management and footwork coming from Stoika. He's able to control the footwork really well and just manage that distance and keep Stofferidis right inside his range. Stoika's been around for a long time, fighting as a pro since 2009. And there's the sunburn I spoke about on the arm. You see there, that's the reddening I spoke about, courtesy of the right round kicks from Stoika early on. Oh, and another one. Now, what he's looking to do by kicking constantly the forearm is to break down the arm, force it to drop. Then he can come loop over the top and kick the head, go for the knockout. Nice combinations thrown by Stoferides. Turning right hook there from Stofferidis. Good step left hand from Stofferidis. Stop Stoika in his tracks. Man, you can start to see just the welts all over both these guys' bodies. You got the right side of Stoika's body and that left shoulder of Stofferidis. Tell you what, hard rounds to score, folks. Let us know your thoughts wherever you're watching around the world. This is 1156 Ersel versus Sandikovic. Good round from both guys. They just basically just traded that shots. There really wasn't a lot of aggression coming from either one of them. No big shots were landed. Everything was kind of on the body and on the arms. The end swell being worked around the face of Stoika, and there's the arm. You see the massive deltoids, the red in there and the forearm. So once again, Stoika looking to get that arm to drop, but also slow down the boxing off that arm, obviously, but also get the arm to drop. 
Once it drops, he loops the shin over the top, tries to wrap it around the neck of the Greek Stoffaridis. Coach is out, let's go. Second round. Big hello to all of our Greek fans watching around the world who'll be celebrating their Easter this weekend, of course. Round two, let's go. Indeed, second round. Stoffaridis, who will be... Celebrating if he gets a big win tonight that could put him in world title contention against Stoika. Oh, Stoika drops him! Mr. KO drops him in the second round. Beautifully placed from Stoika. And Stoffaridis, good save. Walk to me, walk to me. Count here from Justin Brown, wipes off the gloves. Can Stoika capitalize? Three knockdowns in one round, it's over. And here comes Stoika. Can Stoffaridis rally back? Stork is landing some big shots. Oh. He was able to find a home for that left hook. Let's see if he starts to unload right now because he just landed a nice little right hand too. Inside leg kick from Stoika. The momentum flowing through every pore, every vein of the Romanian now. Right hand down the tube from Stoika. Step through knee, didn't find the target. Stoffaridis looks like he's recovered. Can he respond the Greek? Got to get those hands off. Those massive arms carry enormous power. They say beware of Greek sparing guns. The size of the guns on Stoffaridis. Left hook again there from Stoika. Stoika is doing a good job of keeping his head off the center line when he throws shots. So he's not really there for the counter shot. High check from Stoffaridis, nicely done. See, his head's always just a little bit off center. So Stoffaridis is having a hard time finding a home for that big left hand. And Stoika's also doing a good job of controlling that lead foot positioning by keeping his foot just a little bit outside the lead foot of Stoffaridis, which is gonna give him the center lane. This is a very patient, calculated fight so far from Stoika. One half of the famous Stoika fighting brothers, his brother Bogdan Stoika, also on the one Super Series roster. Big right hand there from Andre. Yeah, beautiful, stepped off to the side, went right down the middle. I'd like to see Stoika start putting some combinations together. He's landing just one shot at a time right now, but they're landing, so I guess you can't really argue with what's working. High kick from Stoika. That's the recipe. Try and break down that left arm and thread that high kick upstairs. Fake there from Stoffaridis. Goes the inside fly kick. Nicely done from Hercules. Yeah, those pillars are going to have a hard time coming down. Look at his arm, Michael. Oh, yeah, that's his whole lap. That's a crazy shade of red. Second round. It's a 10 8 round there for Stoika. I had the first round 10 points apiece even. Stoika takes the second 10 8. I've got a 20 18 the Romanian after two. Unofficial. Fair enough. Yeah, you're not a judge. You just pretend to be one on TV. Nice. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at that. Took the leg kick. Came right up top with that left hook. Just the timing on that thing with us was a thing of perfection. Look at that. Found the opening. Boom. Touched him on the chin. <laughs> Very relaxed in the corner of Andre Stoika. Everything right so far. A little more concern in the corner of Yanis Stoffaridis. Inside the Singapore Indoor Stadium, our lead card of 1156, Ersel versus Sadikovic. Inside leg high to the inside fight to open up from Stoffaridis. Oh, another cracking kick to that left side of the body that looks like it's been roasted over a Greek souffle. Double jab, no right hand for company, short left hook. Good high kick, tucks it under the left arm to Stoika. You know, Stoffridis has to realize that he's behind in the count. He's trying to level up right now. He's trying to put some combinations together, but Stoika's doing a really good job of staying protected and covered up. 
and just picking his shots very carefully. That was a nice little left kick that landed to the body of Stoferidis. Stoiker wants his rematch with Roman Kriklia. This would be a major step towards that. Stoferidis, lots of instructions from his corner. See, Stoker does a beautiful job of keeping his head right off to the left. But I wouldn't mind seeing Stoferidis throw that combination and when Stoika starts to lean to his left, then throw that right high kick. Stoika very patient again. Not overextending, not rushing. Justin Brown wants to see a little more action. Right hand lead to a right round kick there from Stoika. Then goes the back leg. Two punch combination from the Romanian. The little break that I do understand, the corner of Stoferidis is saying, go, 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 Bame, Bame, come on, let's go. With one minute 15 remaining. Nice switch kick there. Overhand left from Stoferidis. Uppercut was lazy, the left cross was nice though. Needs to follow through though, Yanis. Yeah, the uppercut just set up that straight left hand, and that touched him on the chin, but there was nothing for company behind it. Nice little skip forward Superman punch. Uh, that was the old Sam Greco technique. Sam Greco made that one famous. Bork rear hand. Knocked out Simon Sweet with that back in the 90s. Left round kick there from Yanis Toforidis. Jumping knee to a left cross from Stoferidis. It's a better round for Stoferidis, though. Oh, he's winning this round. There's no doubt about that. Stoika lands a solid right. Good leg kick to the back leg there from Stoika. Goes the back leg to Stoferidis. That's a Stoferidis round for mine so far, this final round. But he did get knocked down in the second. Counter there from Stoika. 10-9 round for Yanis Stoferidis in the third. Gives it 29-28 on my unofficial scorecard to Andre Stoika Drag. Yeah, he did good work, especially in those first two rounds, but the second round, especially when he was able to score that knockdown. But then in the third, Stoferidis started to come back, but he just needed a knockdown to really make something happen and to sway the judges to his side. So let me say unofficially, I had a drawn 10 all round first, 10-8 second round Stoika, 10-9 third round Stoferidis. That knockdown in the second will certainly be the telling point, I believe. And folks, don't forget, coming up next, our main event of our lead card, Gustavo Ballard takes on Yasuke Saruta. And immediately after that, our main card with six fights coming your way, including two world championships in a double main event. And of course, Jared Brooks versus Volkan Masogliani is going to be something epic. The judges still tabulating. Dom Lau now has the scorecard in his hand. He trots into the circle. And let's go to Dom. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of battle, we turn now to the judges' scorecards. Judge number one calls this contest in favor of Stoika. Judge number two calls this contest in favor of Storforides. And judge number three calls this contest in favor of your winner by split decision, Andre Stoika. Andre Stoika takes the decision here in Singapore. A fantastic light heavyweight kickboxing contest. But the knockdown in the second round proved all the difference. Mr. KO wants his rematch with Roman Kriklia.